a no you look good <laughs> so three-time runner-up at Wimbledon and mixed doubles runner-up this year would you say grass is your favorite surface yeah by far by uh, far yeah it is uh, I always say I wish the grass season was about seven months longer it would be nice uh, I'd be better ranked and uh, yeah I'd have more fun <laughs> And you said in the past that Austin Penko has reached out a lot to play doubles with you, and this year you finally said yes. Well, a lot. I mean, she asked me a couple of times, yeah, or three mm -hmm. times, whatever it was. And, uh, but that was never, I never said no because I didn't want to play with her. It was just that I already had a um, good. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's for the big role. Huh? But, yeah. No, I mean, she, she reached out a couple of times. Mm -hmm. and, um, that was, I never said no because I didn't want to play with her. It was okay. more like I was, uh, I had already uh, made plans, so yeah. I decided not to play. And yeah. then this year it, it was perfect. I was really happy she asked. And then, uh, yeah. Would you say that she had other qualities that, as a Grand Slam winner herself, did she have other qualities that you liked or that she had other over others? Did she have any advantages playing with her besides I mean, hitting you in the back of the head? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's, that's one thing. No, but she's um, she hits the ball really clean. Okay. She hits it heavy and she she absorbs the pace really well. She's mm -hmm. not afraid of the guy, mm -hmm. uh, which which I said before in interviews that it just makes it easy for me. Because I can play. I can literally almost play men's doubles with her. Really? Yeah. Because I know that she can hold the roll and I don't have to throw myself in and just cross on something that's not there. I can wait for the, I can wait for the right opportunity. So she's uh, she lifted me. Yeah. to become a better mixed player. Fantastic. And at, you're 42 years old and you're still going. When you first started a club, going ish, go, going -ish. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but still going strong. Yeah. And you st when you first started to play the Pro Tour, did you initially want to go into doubles as a professional or did you think about going into singles first? No, I mean, uh, every doubles player is a failed single player. I mean, the reality of it. That's, that's the reality of it. Everybody that grows up, you want to become a singles player. Uh, mm -hmm. I should have uh, a, trained much harder than I did when I was trying to play singles. Okay. But I should have realized or where my strengths were. Like okay. even, even as a junior, I was like mm -hmm. much better uh, in doubles. Yeah. In college, I was much better in doubles, and uh, so yeah, I should have probably started sooner than I did, to be honest. And in college, you went to Pepperdine, correct? Yeah. What did you see there that you improved upon that made you want to go pro? Uh, well, I was always going to go pro. The okay. question was just kind of when, mm -hmm. and then uh, uh, I loved the college life, but, mm -hmm. but the tennis in college didn't really kind of sit well with me, so, okay. so that's why I left Pepperdine a bit early mm -hmm. and, and, and tried. But uh, in college, I mean, I learned I learned more to play aggressive doubles. Mm -hmm. I, I was thought that I knew how to play, but my net game developed much more in college okay. than I knew how to play. So going to college was a, a really very solid and good step for me towards my career. And how would you say you? What goals do you set now that you're still playing? How would you say you develop goals? Do you limit your schedule and see how to focus on certain areas more? I mean, I, I wish I could limit my schedule a bit, but okay. then, then I had an injury this year mm -hmm. for two months, and then coming back from that, like it takes another month to get match fit, really. Yeah. So um, the thing I limit myself to more is the way I train. I, okay. I still train hard, but I spend a lot of time just on your own body, like working in the gym and like, and, and trying to eat more right things now. Mm -hmm. So uh, everything around the actual being on court part, okay. uh, I try to work harder on. Awesome, thank you so much, I really appreciate it.